With great fanfare, the official announcement reached Lincoln Cathedral today. That the Prince Charles Philip Arthur George is now, by the death of our late sovereign of happy memory, become our only lawful and rightful liege lord, Charles III. We just came to visit the cathedral and it was lucky that we saw the proclamation here. It's nice that we can uh, commemorate the Queen in, in this wonderful place. It's really nice, especially with the cathedral and everything. It's a big part in history to have like a change of monarch. But even as people wished the new king well, thoughts were still with the recent death of Queen Elizabeth. She was decent, she was um, had humility, uh, she was just incredible. What can I say other than to say thank you to Her Majesty for that life of dedication, of service, of humility, and to pass on the very best wishes of this city, the King's Town, upon the River Hull, to our new King. We go back into mourning this afternoon uh, for the rest of the week and the cathedral will be open for people to come in and mark and pay their respects. Charles III automatically became king when his mother died, but these proclamations are historic traditions formally announcing him as the monarch. The proclamations were made by the high sheriffs of each county before then moving on to different districts. By the grace of God of the United Kingdom, of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Hip, hip, hip! Hooray! Hip, hip, hip! Hooray! God save the King. God save the King. God save the King!